Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I will be unboxing a few items as you can see here that I've been accumulating for this past quarantine. I've been shopping a lot online and let me share with you guys the things that are on sale now if you're interested. I'm gonna leave all of the links down below. So yeah, let's unbox this. So let me start off with the beauty items that I have in here because I've unboxed them already. Sephora right now is delivering packages separately in a very very weird way. Um, so I have some of them here so I just wanted to share it with you guys what I got. I didn't get a lot of beauty items. Um, it's because I do have still have a lot of makeup products but yeah these are just the things that i've been wanting to get and wanted to try so the first one that i got is from smashbox this is the photo finish prime riser i've heard a lot of good things about this but i've never tried it so i only got this small version of this so i picked this up during the spring sale and i just got this now so i probably like waited around two to three weeks for this and the next one that i got is this this is the studio fix nc25 powder because i figured i don't really have any powder with coverage so i wanted something like this and i wanted to be super safe so i go for a mac this is tried and tested so yeah it's just simple studio mac fix plus powder it looks like this so if you're if you guys are wondering i'm nc25 i could go for nc20 to nc15 but this works best for my skin i mean i have this on right now and yeah i have a pimple um so yeah this works and then the next one that i got here is this one this is the tarte shape tape concealer i got the third lighter shade i could have gone a little bit darker because this is like too light for me even though i am very very fair so i got the 12b which is fair beige i'm gonna swatch this for you guys so as you can see i am way too pale and this is like even more paler than me so yeah it's washing out the camera because it's too white but this smells so good like i know i'm like super late with the whole tart shape tape bandwagon that i decided to jump in and join them and so far it's been good like i use this on my under eyes and i don't seem to feel like it's drying my under eyes and then i just got some skincare from spirit spa located in quebec so i thought it'd be good to support local businesses here in canada so i just got the facial wash and the toner so i got the late vip 2 and the lotion p50t so these two items you can only get this from shangri-la the spa in the philippines but but here in canada you can get them from a lot of like derma clinics here and spa clinics so yeah i just got this online and they're so nice to give me like a note which says trina thank you for supporting local businesses and they gave me free samples so they just gave me a pample mousse on to go wipe a sample mask chocolate that's very very nice so thank you to them for giving me samples if you're wondering what is the biologic researcher um this is the same product line that's been used by many many hollywood celebrities i think jennifer aniston uses this also brad pitt and they like it so much that they actually requested not to make a lot of this for other consumers out there that's how they like this but yeah this is fairly expensive that's why i just got like a small bottles but yeah this would last me probably for uh, a month or two the next beauty item that i got is from aliexpress i've been waiting for this even before the whole quarantine it's really nice to like shop from aliexpress but it's gonna take you forever before you get your package i have a few items more from aliexpress that i'm still waiting um but this one is the first one that i got so this is just false lashes oh i didn't realize that this is like super duper fluffy eyelashes but yeah I, I just thought of buying a 
false lashes because I don't really have any false lashes on hand. And then let's get into this few boxes that I have in here. Well, the first one that I got is from Urban Decay. I've been waiting for this because I just got this on sale. So I don't know if it's just me, but I also use tweezers to like open my packages. They were having a massive sale, like 50% off. So I thought it'd be nice to get a nice shadow from them. This has a lot of stuff inside. The only thing that I originally got is this one. This is the Naked Cherry Eyeshadow Palette. So I've been looking for like a mauve type of eyeshadow palette i know i have a new palette that i got from morphe but this one is so pretty i've seen this all around youtube and i thought you know what it's the best time to get it oh this is what it looks like so pretty can't wait to play with this a bunch of samples that one was originally i think around $60. Yeah, that one is originally $68, but I just got them for $34. And then they got me samples. So the first sample that I have is the heavy metal eyeliner. When I went to Korea, I didn't get a chance to get an eyeliner, a glitter eyeliner there because I thought I'm not going to use it. But since this is for free, I got this one. So I got the glitter eyeliner in pyro and then they also got me a sample of all-nighter setting spray so they just got me a small one and then i also got a free rice lipstick and then the urban decay eye eyeshadow primer a bunch of paper inside i think that's everything that i got for beauty item the next thing that i have here is this one this is actually a gift from my husband so he got me this one for my i think it's for my birthday so this is from fossil so he just got me a watch i've been wanting this and they were on sale guys like they were on i think like 70 percent off so this was originally around i don't know i'm gonna leave all the products here and how much i got them for but yeah, this is what the box looks like. So pretty. And I like the detailing. At first, I opted for a like a rose gold one but you know i figured the two-tone would look very very classy kind of looks like you're wearing um a rolex or something the next few items that i'll be sharing with you i'm just gonna briefly just show it to you because they're clothes like i'm not really like that fashionista but yeah they were on sale and i never really had like a good leather jacket so i figured it, it'll be the best time for me to get one so this is what it looks like so I just got a medium sized leather jacket from Vera Moda. Um, this was originally $80 but I got this for $40 so they were 50% off and it just looks like this so I figured it's kind of the best spring jacket so I just got this. And then the next thing that I got is from one of my favorite store here in Canada it's called the RW & Co like they're kind of like on a higher end when it comes to like fast fashion sense i'm not saying they're they're a fast fashion but you know it's kind of like a zara i think i already bought a lot of items before so i just got two items this time so the first one that i got is this one yeah it just looks like this i thought it'd be like a good good spring cardigan so this one is $150 kind of like a long coat I'm gonna insert the picture here so you guys know what I'm talking about so yeah I got that one and the next thing that I got is just a simple drape cami um, and I thought this is like super on trend right now that's why I decided to get it so last but not the least I got these two items that I wanted to share with you guys I got them from Best Buy and they were on sale kind of heavy so this is just the HP DeskJet 3755. I got this for $29, guys. And I also left my laptop in the Philippines. I used the 
um, HP something gold. This is why I decided to get an HP printer. I thought this is a really, really nice brand. I decided to get my husband a laptop. It's very, very cheap. They were on promo. Like if you get a laptop, you get the printer for just $29. This kind of took a while as well. So this is what it looks like inside. So inside, I got this laptop from Lenovo. This is like very affordable, I think. This was on sale. I'm not sure if, if it was on sale. I think this is not the new model. Um, that's why this is like very affordable. We thought that we need a laptop anyway, so it doesn't matter if we get an Apple or what, but Apple is like super expensive and also my husband is not used to Apple. He's always been like an Android guy and he likes windows and stuff like that also i find apple to be like super not user friendly that's why i always go for this type of laptops i got a chromebook just looks like this very very classic and just simple and i love that and yeah it's just a small notebook laptop i guess um, and then inside they just have the chargers and stuff so this is what it looks like and what's the nice thing about it is that if you buy a laptop like you get a really really good deal so we got the home mini google mini something so i thought this would be really really helpful when he's doing his homework and whatnot this is just the google home mini in charcoal and this is what it looks like inside yeah we just got the charcoal version i'm gonna set this all up and see if this is really really helpful for us but yeah that's that so once you buy a laptop you, you can get this printer for 29 dollars this is like very very helpful for us because if you guys didn't know um my husband is currently studying here in canada he used to also study culinary in Sydney but now we're here in Canada just thought I'd share it with you guys because this is like a really good deal if you're looking for something to use for your school or for your work at home I know that everyone is like working at home right now so this kind of deals are very very helpful so that's everything that I wanted to share with you guys I know this is like a very very random haul but I just thought of sharing this with you in case this is like helpful to anyone so I'm not really like a techie person so I will be figuring out how to set up all of this but yeah thank you guys for watching and stay safe as always and i'll see you on my next one bye